friends. Good morning. Happy it's Thursday. On January 28th, and she said, Who <clears throat> and then Turn the TV down a little bit. So I've already got my peel base on. I am just waiting for it to dry. Today we're using Black Dahlia Lacquer's peel base. I love this brand. I never have issues uh, popping off. I put one layer on over my jelly tips. And um, works great. Hope everybody's doing well today. I'm going to pull up the live. So the teacher's old story about like, yeah, they were, they were there, you know, there we go. overwhelming, kind of age of mine, and I can't help with some of that's true, some of that's true. Mm -hmm. At 10.30 p.m., right. there was a FaceTime fun road. Put it over here. Hey, Patty, good morning. You're first. So yeah, I already have my peel base on, too. Since you missed the live yesterday, this is the Manny I did, Patty. So, um, it's dip powder from Crival. The purple is Phantom and the pink is, um, Namaste Single. And then I use the purple gel polish from Luxie and then a black gel liner to do the nail art. The leopard spots. How are you doing? How, um... Are you still, are you still, uh, at the mechanic or are you done? Thank you. So, we you know how the company was it that sent me. Oh, you know how Emily sent me the poly gel? They want me to make a video, too. So I'm going to have to do that and the Rossi one, work on those this weekend, like film them. Film me doing it and then edit it later. I don't even think I have enough space on my phone to film a video that long. <laughs> Hi, Mallory. Are you still there, Patty? Hi, Tara. Good morning, ladies. How is everybody doing today? I already have my peel base on by the time I came live. So let me tell you what we're doing. Okay, I'm going to use these two colors from Munda's Nail Dips. And I'm also going to use Erica or Negligee from Dipnotic. I've never used it though. We're doing a peekaboo, by the way. Uh, not on all nails, just two accent nails. Um, so I'm doing another uh, Manny where my accent nails are going to be the middle and ring because I just think that's going to look the best for this Manny. Um, and then my thumb, pinky, and index are going to be green. And then we're going to do on the two accent nails, peekaboo nails with either Erica or this uh, sheer pink. I'm just nervous because I haven't used it in a peekaboo, you know. So we're going to do that on the two accent nails. Um, Apple Teeny is the name of this dip. It's green, yellow, and pink are the main colors. There's a lot of iridescence in it, too. And then Limeade, it speaks for itself, right? You can save at Moon Dust Nail Dips. Uh, it's an Etsy shop. So it's, uh, if you want a link, it's like www.etsy.com slash shop slash Moon Dust Dips. Thank Moon Dust Dips and not Moon Dust Nail Dips. Let me just double check. Yeah, Moon Dust Dips. Okay. So I just got to wait for these to dry. It will be good. And I came up with a design. Actually, I went to my inspo pictures, my saved inspo, one of my inspo folders. Now I have them like broken down, kind of like some are holidays, some are like, um, I have uh an animal animal print folder animal print 
uh, designs. I have marble folder for marble nail designs. I have, um, then I have like Christmas, Valentine's Day, all that stuff, you know, all broken down. But at the beginning when I started, I just started a folder called Nail Inspo. And that's just like my generic folder. So sometimes I'll save it to Nail Inspo, but then I'll also break it down further and put it in one of my other files if, if I have something appropriate, you know. I have a file called me. Whenever my picture is used by a company, I save it and put it over there and there. In there. <laughs> <gasps> Mallory, they did not offer me any money. Hold on. Yeah, they didn't offer me any money. You're going to have to give me more information on that. They just gave me free product, and even the bottles, the dip liquids they sent me are just sample dips. So, like regular size plastic bottles, they're plastic, but um, it's got like 0.33 milliliters of liquid in, in them or something. Let me look. It's right here. Uh, 0.67 fluid ounces. My bad. Huh. Yeah, but they don't. I'm not doing a whole video. Like, they want a video, but like a short one. You know what I mean? Like a couple of minutes. Two minutes. Really? So. So company, Mallory, what about like Cosmic and Luxie and those ones? I know they're affiliates, but you don't get paid besides that, right? Hmm. Now you got me all thinking, Mallory. <laughs> but others, yeah. I see you got in with candy skincare, Mallory. You didn't say anything, but I noticed you using a code now, so congratulations. I don't know what's going on with Dip With Me. I haven't heard from them, and I haven't seen Valerie posting using their products or nothing. And she's an, I've been, like, the only one. I wonder if I like, should just stop. Like, she hasn't put anything new out. She hasn't. I don't know. All right. We are dry. Let's start with this green solid limey. Okay, so oh, I see Mallory. Model on stip liquids again. So pinky index thumb are going to be the screen color. I'm worried it's not going to look very good on me, but I've had this duo for a little bit. I had to kind of use it. Oh, this has like a little bit of a shimmer in it. It's pretty. Yeah, 
that from Dougie Scanty because she was gone for a few hours. Yep. So on, 20, on the it makes sense actually. On the 28th, we dropped the bag with Dan and Jermaine. It's not very popular in Dougie Scanty. They met on at a. What are you guys all up to today? Do tell. On the 30th, Dominic's still dogs. sleeping. Right, so Some blue dip right under right my right finger right now right from right yesterday. Right or the right other right Manny, right my hypnotic right Manny. Right. I have to take my anxiety medication. I meant to take it 20, at 25 of 11. And then I came in here and it's out in the kitchen, so I didn't take it. I just remember now. But I seem, as long as I'm not too shaky, I'll be okay. So it takes like a half hour before it works anyway. I still am rewatching parts of the Letitia Stout trial. It was still um, her daughter testifying or whatever. All right, looks good. Oh yeah, I'm paid waiting. One caller Manny yesterday. Are you talking about Tara's Manny? Yeah. Oh, really? That's you're talking about dipped in fairy dust, right? Patty's at the mechanic getting an oil change and a spot taken, a spot cleaned in your car, Patty. Or don't you have a truck? truck, right? See if I have enough dip in this jar to get my own bum. I think we do. On January 50th, when they were from one band to the other. She said, going right yes, Patty, you do have a truck. Yeah. Are Good they working on it now, or are you waiting for them to work on it? You've been there for a bit right now. Did you have an appointment, or did you, you just go in? Okay. Let's brush these off. We'll do our second dip. This is really good coverage. I'm impressed. Yeah, super good coverage. It's not streaky or anything. It applied really nice for a lighter color, you know. I wonder if this color glows. I don't think it does, though. <laughs> Spa day for your car. <laughs> oh, that's cool. She lives near you. Oh, my goodness, Patty. That's a long time to wait. What do they charge for an oil change down there? It's like 30 bucks here, I think. 
at like that's on the cheap side. Yeah, I'll find one thirty somewhere. All right, one more dip on our thumb. We'll have good coverage. Oh my God, a hundred. <laughs> Oh, at Toyota. All right. Well, if you go there, you're going to pay more. But like we have like one of those, I forget what it's called, but it's an oil change place. It's a chain of them, you know, and I think it's like, well, the last I remember it was like 30. But $110 to change the oil. <laughs> I'd be, uh, I'll teach myself how to do it before I would pay that. That's ridiculous. Hey, did you say a hundred? Hi, Brett. Chastity. Hey, guys. How are you both? I can't believe Chastity's here. She hasn't been here in so long. What's up to you, girl? And Britt, how are you today? I'm doing the Moon Dust Nail Dips Manny. And this color I'm um, just finishing up with is called Limeade. Limeade. And then my two accent nails, you guys. I'm going to do peekaboo nails with um, a sheer pink and a glitter called Apple Teeny. So this is the duo. And then we'll use the pink on the uh, peekaboo nails. But Apple Teeny Limeade. You hungry, Jess? Yes. Oh my goodness, Tara, that's crazy. <gasps> oh, where is she? What school is she going to, Chas, today? That's awesome. Tell her congratulations, big day. Getting set up, what do you mean? Like getting her schedule and stuff? Or is, is today drop off day? Is she living there? All these questions I have. All right. <clears throat> Let's get the glitter out. So I'm just going to use dip base and I'm going to put it at the top of the nail. Um, like the top third. That's how much I usually do. And I kind of like to come down the side a little. This is just my personal preference. I'm going to pour over. Actually, I think I should lay flat. It'll give me better coverage and maybe I'll only have to do one layer of it. Name on the 
Let me grab a plastic bag so I can press these down. It's chastity sand. This. Catch up at work for you? Oh, that's awesome, chastity. The what around there? Oh, the quiet. You're in a college town, Tara? All right, I do see some more spaces I want to put some glitters, like over here. I'm just going to dab on some base and a few spots where it's a little thin and where I just want to add a little more to it. Okay. Glitter on my brush. All right, it's good. So that's like how I was going for the top for my glitter to look, right? How it's longer on the, uh, the sidewalls, you know, at the sides, and um, a little higher up. in the center it's exactly what i wanted so i'm gonna leave make sure my glitters are flat and then i'm just gonna leave it for now and put the glitter also you know on the next nail all right yeah i gotta go get my medication i'm sorry tripping all over my words here A bunch of glitter stuck on my finger. Give me one sec to run to the kitchen, please. All right. All right, I'll feel better in a half hour. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay, Tara. A couple streets over, huh? You like this, Patty? You like the glitter? This was one I bought. I bought this glitter, this duo. Yes. All right, let's see how this is going to be. Looks pretty good. Um, that Sunday morning, you got all the glitter on my hand. I think I'm going to do the same thing and just go in and place some base where um, the glitter is a little light, sliding all over the place right now. Mailman coming. I have something from Timu out for delivery. I think it's just a portable speaker. Let me go grab it. Sorry, I'm getting up again now. All right, I did get something from Timu, but I also got something from Double Dipped. So she was going to start sending out stuff for us to promote. 
was wondering if she was going to send anything to me because I've seen Allie do a couple posts with stuff. So I thought maybe I didn't know what her plan was with me. So now I know. Okay, there's two dips in here. Okay, I'll check them out after, but one's called Dracula is back, and one is, is a thermal and a glow. The other one's called Tornado. That's cool. All right. Let's see. So this should be dry now. Okay, good. Definitely have to add more glitter to this one than the last one. Okay. Oh, what's that? On Monday. Yes. And you saw you were in the house. Yes. You actually, when you left that one, how are you dressed? All right, that should be all right. Okay. I think it comes down a little further on my ring finger, but. I don't think it's really noticeable. I'll look at it again. Yeah, I think it'll be fine. Okay, tell me what you guys think. I'll show you in a second. Think it's all right? All right, so I'm going to ombre this sheer pink. Try not to spill any of the glitter. There we go. Okay. Grab an ombre brush. All right, so I, yes. I'm going to go pretty much just to the where the glitter begins, okay, for this part. Oh, I forgot to do clear. Shoot, all right. I got to do a layer of clear. Put her on there. And you only need to cover the glitter, <laughs> but I had already put base down further. Here, I'm just going to cover the glitter with the glitter. So that time I only put it on um, the glitter. Let's close this up for now. So we're not, because we already uh, encapsulated the glitter here, we're not going to encapsulate these nails again. So that's one good thing about it. <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to go in with this sheer pink. I like to use Erica, but I'm going to give negligee, which is 
a really sheer, uh, which is a sheer pink, but I've never done a peekaboo with it. So we're going to try it today. See how this color goes. All right, so now again, I'll go in with the dip base, just about up to where the glitter is. Maybe cover a couple, you know. Actually, let me, I think I can lay flat for this. I'm going to. I might not even need the ombre brush, we'll see. Doing the same thing now on this nail and just going about up to where the glitter starts and then we'll lay into the pink. So this is what they're looking like. I think, Let's see if it's ready to be wiped off. It's still a little tacky. Okay, that's better. And then at some point later that evening, uh, okay. All right. Yes. So there's one layer. Now I'm going to go up higher on my second layer to cover. This is pretty sheer, you can say. Um, so I'm going to go up maybe like halfway up the glitters, right? And I'm going to lay into the... Uh, Powder. So this looks, it's, it's kind of coming off more nude, I think, than pink. Well, that'll be something different I've never done before either. Okay, let me get the second dip. That looks good. Let me brush these off. Okay, we gotta do one more layer of pink. Um, I think I'm gonna stay about where I am. I might come up a little higher on the ring finger, but I'm gonna stay about this far up on the middle now. Hmm. I have like a little dip in this now where it kept not picking up. See how that works. Um, it was Dallas and Christine. And you drove that first day all the way to the 
was like, I don't know how about it. Yes. Okay. We got into Amarillo. And then the next day, we went, we moved from Amarillo to the Cater Yes. Mm -hmm. That's only a four and a half hour long drive. See a little spot over here that's kind of bare. I want to fix it. You talked about your mom making reservations at the Sugar Hotel. Yes. She was actually making those reservations for the house, wasn't she? I remember I sent a reservation for the call. The living call. Yeah, okay. A little bumpy, a couple spots, but I won't file that out. Oh, got up. And then when was it decided? So, was it decided in Amarillo and then Cater that Texas was a um, sidewall on my ring finger? <laughs> oh, bumpy. All right. I kept having the same spot where the dip went in. It wasn't going over. I ended up doing it a few times. All right, so this is definitely, if you've never done a peek, but this is like a trust the process moment you're going to have right here. Okay, um, definitely a lumpy, right? See, um, but we'll fix all that. Okay. We do have to encapsulate our green nails, though, so let's just go ahead and do those real quick. So it's weird. This brush is like not covering it. Oh, no not point. covering it really. Hey, so it's like skipping over spots. I don't see. I wonder if there's something on it. I just don't see it. I see a black glitter. It works if I go little by little, but if I just try and pull it, it like leaves a lot of uh, bare spots. Now we can go and activate the nails once they brush off. Use up the base bottle. Don't forget to do that. I forget a lot, but 
I do at least one mani a day so it doesn't sit too long, you know, before it's noticed. But if you do a mani a week or something and you leave that open, it's not going to stay good. It's going to get all goopy. I had to press this baby down. Oh my god, you can still like see through my nail right over here, you guys. That's odd. I think I'm going to have to put more dip there. Wow. Huh. Psyched it's Thursday. I think we're supposed to be going to the beach this weekend. I mentioned I haven't mentioned it to Nick this week yet, but uh, I'm gonna ask him tonight. I wanna do something because we really haven't done anything this week summer besides go to the beach a few times so i want to take them to the movies or trampoline park or something All right, I gotta, um, <clears throat> I have to put something down here. It's like a huge, super noticeable spot. It needs to be fixed. But I just don't want to contaminate the brushes, you know, so I think I can wait a minute. I'll catch up on comments. Hi, Michelle. You can't see any of the chat, Mallory? Michelle, I'm doing a Moon Dust Nail Dips Manny, right? Uh, Peekaboo, but instead of using Erica as my sheer pink, I used Negligee from Dipnotic, which is a little different. It's more nudie. <laughs> more nude. Um, but I just activated, but I, I have a spot over here on my nail that like did not get dip on it. So I have to go in there and kind of build it up a little bit because it's super noticeable. And once it is filed, you're going to be able to see the difference in the color. So I have to. And at that point in time, you'd already see the problem on that. And so, and this all of this is going to be. In the meantime, I'm waiting on these two hardened. I'm going to try and put some base and pour over to fix this.
Okay, actually, I think that's going to make it better. Just that one. Yeah, so Looks pretty good. All right, I'm happy. Er, happier. <laughs> I'll brush it off and reactivate it. <clears throat> the other nail should be ready to file. <clears throat> You work in Michelle. Yes. All right. Give myself a little bit of a clean up, clean area here, all right? I always start my filing with my pinky. All right, so once I'm happy with how the cuticle area <clears throat> looks, right, <clears throat> excuse me, you just want to file down your sidewalls, make sure there's no bumps or anything there. Mine looks good. Same with this side, it looks good. And then once you're happy with that, you can shape your free edges. Or uh, this is how I do it anyway, you know. Um, if you're looking for a way to do it, you could do it this way. If you already have your routine, keep doing your thing. Okay. And then the last thing I like to do is just to make sure that there's no bumps on, on the underside of my nail. To make sure everything's even, you know, and smooth. Well, not even necessarily smooth at this point. I'm just shaping my nails for now. Let's skip that ring finger. We'll come back. Actually, yeah, we'll come back to the ring finger because we had to patch up that spot. So that was the last nail that was activated. This nail is going to take a little bit of filing because I showed you, you know, you guys see that there's lumps, right? Try and show you from this angle, but it's a little more awkward. But it's just, it's lumpy, okay? <laughs> take my word for it. So now these nails, we did not, we only encapsulated the glitter. So, um, you know, you are going to want to be somewhat careful filing the glitter that you don't file through. But at the same time, I'm going to, I want to remove some of, a little bit of this pink up near the top. So I'm going to go in 
I'm actually, and at the same time, I'm going to smooth the nail. And just go little by little so you can, you know, see what you're doing and don't over, so you don't over file anything. Okay. Okay. Okay, starting to um, come along here. Right now I'm using the 100 grit side, but I'm using a light touch, you know. I just I still have to shape the free. I will show you guys what this nail is looking like. <laughs> So, um, I think it's enough. The last couple of times I've done a peekaboo, I have overfiled. It's hard to tell when it's dry, but then when it gets wet, yeah, you know, you can actually see um, more of the glitter popping out. So, I think this is probably good. So, now I'm just going to do my free edges and then the underside. All right, let's do these two green nails. These will be nice and easy before we go and do the ring finger. Your puppy sitting, your friend's food? Oh, <laughs> not easy like yours. Oh, okay, Mallory. I'm glad it's working now. All right, good. Britt, how's your day going, girl? So your your puppy your pup sitting while working too. Do your dogs does your dog get along with with the pup the poodle that you're watching? Remember that 
I have to go online. My mother said she'd buy Dominic three outfits, so she told me to go to either Amazon or Walmart because he's outgrown the children's place. And pick out three outfits. So I told Dominic he had like no interest in it. I'm like, all right, well, I'll, I'll choose for you then. <laughs> yeah. You know. He's not interested yet in his clothes. Although he did specifically ask for Crocs. But that was for summer shoes. You know, that was a few months back. Ready for the day to be over? Oh, your sister's moving to call. Oh, Britt, tomorrow, huh? So you're having dinner with the fam tonight? What are you guys going to eat? Do you know where you were living when she dated Travis? Travis. How long did you? Mr. Tony asked me about how to resolve something. I'm choosing this light so I can see what I'm doing here. Much better. Okay. Right now I gotta do the ring finger. There's lots of bumps on this now. So we'll see how how good we can make it look. It's like a challenge. <laughs> I'm going to stop there with the filing on the top, I think. getting nice and smooth. It's smoothing out perfectly. So. Nice, because it was a hot mess. <laughs> about uh, 
All right. Let's buff the nails real quick. Hey, Grandis. Ooh, Mexican. Yeah. That sounds so good, Brett. You must like Mexican because you had it with Julie, too. Your dog gets along with her, Michelle. Jordan's dog, not so much. Uh, oh. You must have like a runner out in your yard, right? Hook her up to that. <laughs> Brandis, I'm doing a moon dust nail dips mini. And guess what I found this morning, you guys? I was so excited. Hold on. Sirena, I found it. It was like on its side, like in my drawer, like this. So it was like something you just didn't notice. And I'm like, oh, could that be it? And it was. Oh, I'm happy. Anyway, I'm using limeade and apple teeny. And then a sheer pink. I'm doing a peekaboo. It's almost like it's actually a nude. It's um hypnotic nails. Um, it's called negligee. I think I might have overfiled my middle nail, you guys. I might have to like go in and put a little more, sprinkle a little pink up over these glitters. We'll see what they look like after I activate them, or after I clean them, I mean. See my ergo file. Brandis, how are you today? I gotta check the weather forecast, see what's going on. I didn't even see it for today, and it was sunny this early this morning, but now it's all cloudy again. Just like how it's been for several days now. This is depressing weather, you know. Rainy cloudy is. It's the weather where you don't even want to get dressed. <laughs> kind of day. You love Mexican? It's a fave? We had tacos last week. <laughs> I love Mexican too. I love just eating tortillas with salsa and sour cream. I snack on that a lot at home. But I, I want the sour cream with it. Did you That looks good. I am gonna sprinkle some 
now has like a little unevenness. I just want to smooth it. Mm -hmm. Buffing didn't smooth it. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Um. Yeah, look at my middle nail, guys. It. Well. Let's clean them with some alcohol and see what they look like. I'll, I'll make a decision then. It's hard to tell until they get wet. If they, what's going to be peeking through here? I was so worried this green was going to look really bad on me. I think... I think it'll be all right. Uh, yeah, because even if I tap some on, I'm going to have to smooth it all out. So I guess I'm That's leaving good. it. Not my best, not my worst. But Let's activate. Oh, I think there were some spots on my nails I needed to use this for. Yeah, right here. Up here. Oh, I got a spot up here on my middle nail. It's just bare. That corner right there. It's just bare. <laughs> There's no glitters. I'm going to have to fill that with glitter. Oh, I got a hang nail too. I'm gonna need to get rid of that on my pinky. All right, I gotta put some glitters in there. Let's see. So that we can see a t Little shaky. Let me have plastic bags. Pat that down. Okay. Um, Ms. Hunt, did you see a large green suitcase loaded with the site? Close it up. Or some activator on it. You have a specific recollection of any part of his body, like his hands, face, or any part of his actual skin. I will never see this The morning of the first day in Pensacola, Florida, 
All right, wait a second, and then we'll um, top. Actually, while we're waiting, I should try and get that um, hangnail off. Let's try this bit, this ball bit. Still a little bit of skin there, but I guess I'm just gonna have to leave it as is. Yes. Oh, are you planning to do nails today? You feeling? You feeling much better, Brandis? Oh, that's awesome to hear. Oh, good. On the 21st? Oh, that's good. That's just a few days. All right. Let's close this up. I'm going to wipe off um, the nails now. And then we'll top coat them. I've been using these model ones. Dip liquids. Remember yesterday I had a problem with it drying over the gel on these two nails, right? Uh, so from now on, whenever I do gel nail art, I'm just going to uh, top coat with gel. Normally that's what I do. It's just I prefer dip top coat, you know, so I try to use it whenever I can. I already did that now. Brandis, I'm using limey. That's the solid green. And then the glitter is apple teeny. Okay, let's do layer number two now. See some top coat on my skin. <laughs> <Why> <laughs> <are you getting laughs> <out>? <laughs> 
why didn't she think that was weird? Or why didn't she demand her clothes? Or like, um, yeah, if I be with an abuser like that, you will know the answer. So this is what they look like. So I really think what Letitia said is what happened. We do not backchat her, and she said, we do not ask questions or anything like that. Um, yes, it's an appeal upon this in how you did well. She's not much interested in the thoughts of the mother. Mm -hmm. I probably she should have used a white instead of a pink. I thought the pink would go good because there was pink in this glitter. But now when I'm looking at it, I'm like, oh, I should use white. But that's just me picking it apart, thinking, oh, you know, woulda, coulda, shoulda. But it's still pretty cute. Maybe I should have just done one peekaboo nail and one full glitter nail, but that's like a design I have done so many times. I wanted to change it up, you know, so I went with the two peekaboo, but I wish I did at least one full glitter nail somewhere on the index finger or something, you know. So but, oh well. She was telling me that she was on the phone with the whole time that there's going to be a video out there that's going to prove her innocence. And also, she didn't talk about Ganon much, but she was talking about this video that also showed Ganon. I know you like you greens, know, Brandis, but I always think of you as liking mint greens more than others. Is that true or no? Do you like all greens? So I totally thought I ordered the chartreuse uh, duo. It's like... They're calling it the Colors of the Fall Chartreuse, the Color of the Fall. So they released a duo. One's called Charlie, and it's a solid that glows. And the other one's called Truce, and it's a glitter, a uh, like small glitter mix or whatever. But it turns out when my order came, my Revelous Club with the dips I had ordered wasn't in there. So I, well, I, I ordered it. Um, so now I will have it. Because, Britt, I figure I got to share that with you, girl. <laughs> neon green and mint green. Okay. I usually like neon greens, too, but I just don't think it does much for my skin coloring. You know what I mean? But, um, like hunter green and stuff, those look good. Like darker greens, I think, look better on me than the lighter greens. Yeah. Did you get your Revelous Club August dips then? Since you're talking about teals, how gorgeous are they this month? So gorgeous. Huh. Why'd you send a message to Christy? About what? Yes, and also, Nancy, you still have a chat for your speaker. You were saying. Was that you asking about the thermals for Christopher Halloween? Oh, don't even say that, Tower. No, it wasn't. I checked my order history. I didn't order it. <laughs> yeah, definitely, because Tower and I usually twin every month. I think there's been a couple times we haven't, but usually every month we do something with them. So I'm totally down, Brenda, if you want to. Tower, do you? With August. Oh, Britt, you saw. Oh, Britt, you didn't even see him yesterday. Look. Where are they? Well, here they are. This is August Revelous Club Dips, you guys. Let me put my light up. Is that better? So this is like blue and like a yellow gold, which mixes to make like that teal color you get, you know? I know you like those, Brit. Okay, so to continue on with these notes, Prival Patty. Prival. I know, aren't they super pretty? Alright, let's see if we're dry. 
And everything dried perfectly today, so I'm convinced it had to do with the gel polish, as we, gel polishes we used yesterday. Or is it just the glitter making it look like a bump? I hate how glitters can like F with your manis and make your nails look warped and stuff. Like if you have a particular si uh, shape or color glitter now the side wall or up near your cuticle, it can throw the whole thing off and make your nail look misshapen. And tell me that's how, no, it never happened to you guys. All right. What you guys think is Dirty, actually, let me use the last of my apple honey champagne cuticle oil from Room Dust. It smells so good. Anyway, she sells oils in 10 milliliter roller balls or one, milli, uh, one ounce bottles. And she's releasing some new fall scents. So, um,. Her stuff smells really good. This apple honey champagne, I love it. It smells so good. Oil up my other hand. I was thinking what color sleeve to do today, nail face sleeve, but I think I'm gonna go with like white or something. Or maybe I'll do denim. Because she really thought the following them because she was a killer on I the run. Too dead. Uh -huh. Maybe dead. Uh, welcome to the Yes, and Melissa says Hollywood I can find it by feel. Yeah, it's not too hard to find. She sent me another button. I put it. I think it's somewhere in the box to change it out. It's a cuter button too. I forget what it is, but it is cute. Whoops. I could just use my denim coat. <laughs> Said that to Albert, right? March 2nd, Holly was hit with the Twitter, and then there with the police, there they did they sweat. And then the sleeve. Holly could leave the teacher all the way from November 2022. And then she broke down today, being like, I'm so sad I lost my abstract ring. <laughs> I keep saying it, but it was a three piece set I got off of Amazon. It had this butterfly ring. It had this ring, and then it had my favorite one. It had this one, and then I had my favorite one, which kind of like came down a little and like sat on. The, it was just so adorable. I loved it, and it's gone. That reminds me that I have some other rings oh, right here that are kind of like climbing rings. Like this. The only thing is when you bend your hand, it like, well, no, that actually might work. I think I'll wear this one on my middle now. A little smaller one, flowers. Here, let's try that one. Let's do that one. It's pretty. So here is my finished Manny. I know I'm holding my fingers at an awkward angle. I'm trying to pose it for you guys, but I'm, you know, hanging low here. So <laughs> thank you so much for being here for today's live. I hope you guys enjoyed it. All right. Really? You can't? Make yourself some. Now that you have all the tools for it, you could probably, or, or do the poly gel rings. <laughs> Make your own. 
Yeah, but it's true. Most of like the ring sets I get, like at least half of them, I can't wear because they're too big. And you want them extra small because they're midi rings. You know what I mean? So that's why I like Pura Vita and um, companies like that because they sell rings in size three and a half. And I think four is the smallest Pura Vita goes. But um, trying to think of that company on Etsy I've bought from a few times. Can't think of her name, but her rings start at size three and a half. And I could definitely get you the link if anybody wants it. But her rings are like pricey, you know, between 15 and 20 bucks. So, have a wonderful afternoon, you guys. Um, and I'll see you back here tomorrow. It's going to be Friday. Mm -hmm. So happy uh, everybody seems to be feeling well today and doing well. Let's keep it going, right, for all of us. There's wood under there. <laughs> Love you guys. Bye.